Hey, what's up everybody? It's your boy, The Crazy Man. So it's Saturday and um, I decided to overhaul my website uh, because I had, uh, I took a hard look at my website and it looked very, <clears throat> it was too polished, it was too um, business-like. And um, I really landed on the fact that I need to promote me as a creator and change the look and the feel of the website. So I currently use Wix and it's a Saturday. I was going to go to um, the Garden State um, comic event and uh, I chose to spend this day today just doing this. And then as, as I started working on it, I realized, hey, why don't I take people uh, walk you through what I do and so it's not gonna be that glamorous cuz I'm just gonna be overhauling the site so I'm gonna show you what I mean um, by it was uh, in my opinion I felt it was too co too commercial uh, and not it didn't truly represent me as a creative it was more it looked like a, a very too busy so I'm going to navigate here, go to the domain homepage. So, so this is the homepage where you land on. So we just, I just, you know, George and I just finished doing PowCon. So you open up with the blog. Um, so you get to check that out. And then uh, right below it has tour dates, you know, where we're going next. Uh, well, I'm going because George um, decided to take a pass on 2021 with comic book events. So is where I will be. So currently I'm confirmed for PowCon, I mean, for ZoloCon in July, uh, the 17th and 18th, and that is in Bucks County, PA. And then in August, I will be at um, EternalCon, Long Island Comic Con, and that's August 7th and 8th. I'm waiting for confirmation for the New York Comic Con, so uh, we'll talk about that and get closer. Um, so. And then, you know, when you go by, you know, just scroll down. This is where it ends. So I'm going to overhaul the main page as well. But this is where it ends. And, um, you know, so if I went to the site itself, right now I'm currently on my YouTube channel. So if I went to crazycomics.com uh, and I just showed you, right, it'll open up, but then it'll go to the um, this. Welcome to the craze, blah, blah, blah. And you enter the site. Very business. So then it opened up to the vlogumentary, which is pretty cool. Um, I recently just changed the main page because it was very busy. But if you go to books, look at all the sub pages. So just in my books, if I go to books, that's one page. And then I have Arg and Mandy Pandy and Scary Egg. These are all my kids' books, right? And so there's just so many pages, right? And then you go to comics, you got Cosmic Wars, Forbidden, uh, Duty, you have videos. Um, and then you go to Cast the Craze, you know, become a sponsor, Cast the Crazies, uh, the Crazies character design, right? Then you got the blog, then you got a, about me, then you got the bio, and then the portfolio, then you got more fan page, fan art, contact shop. It's just so much. And so, like, if I hit on books, so you got the main, you know, all the kids' books that I've created, right? And the fact that they're available, right? But each one of those books has its own page. So if I want to, Arg. It has its own page, right? Um, you know, and I just felt that it was too much. So, you know, if you went to comics, you know, you have all the titles, and then you have, you know, the titles have their own page as well. Each title, Cosmic Wars. Cosmic Wars has its own page. Right, you know, has the trailer, um, the sliders. It's just too busy, in my opinion. Then you go to cast the craze, and really, it just allows you to um, listen to a lot of the episodes if you've missed anything, right? Um, and then you know, you can subscribe to the channel. Then you have to become a sponsor page. You know that I will leave. This is the page where if you want to be a sponsor of the episodes. You have individual deals and you have package deals uh, right below. Um, and then you got Cast the Crazies, right? In its own page. Uh, so all of this is going to change. Um, and uh, 
then you have the craziest character design page you know there's no need for this uh, <laughs> and i'm talking i just i so i'm the one who created this but i'm like there's no need for this man. this is you're nuts i got the block right um and the blog will stay, but then you got the about. Um, and then this. Definitely very, very corporate looking. So that's going to go. Um, and then the bio. Right? The bio page will stay. Uh, everybody needs an about page, right? Then you got the portfolio. Right? So... Uh, and this is you know my part throughout the years so how do i condense this into six links six sub pages total instead of let's see one two three four five six seven eight nine ten eleven twelve thirteen fourteen fifteen sixteen seventeen eighteen nineteen twenty twenty one twenty two twenty three twenty four twenty five twenty six nobody has time for this yet what were you thinking so this is where i am now so currently i'm going to change comics to one page so if you go to comics um i gotta see here because i got this thing in my way so i'm changing it to just one page it's gonna be the one landing page and that's it it's a one-stop shop and if you want to um uh buy the books directly from me and this is what i'm working on now you're gonna i'm I will be um, selling the books directly through the website, physical and ebooks. So you'll be able to get every book in my inventory, every book that I've ever created, um, will be able to be able to buy from me directly. Um, so we'll start off with Cast of Crazies, which is the flagship title for what I've been doing um, since I've come back into comics. So there it is. So coming soon, issue three. Um, and again, issue three will be available once the uh, Kickstarter campaign. Kickstarter has given us the funds right now. They're still uh, reconciling. There's a couple of people that still um, they're waiting for um, to um, pay. If and then I think I think today's the last day. If they don't pay, whatever it they collected is what they're going to distribute to us. Um, so, uh, so to start off with this. So this is what I'm working on now. So I started off, I've redid this whole uh, page. So it starts off there and I moved down. I'm leaving, um, I'm currently working on it. That's why that blank area is there. Here's going to add all of the other cover options that are available to purchase and then forbidden, right? Successfully funded on Indiegogo. Um, the summary, who, who worked on it. And then here, uh, oh, I have to add my new colorist to this. And you know basically look for the graphic novel in the in winter 2021 but here are the books that are available to purchase right now from the forbidden collection so you have the standard cover by Ani Royal up here and then you have the very the gold cover by me uh the hollowful cover by david Quiles, the sketchbook uh, and then you have the commission sketch cover and then numbered one to a hundred so far number three is available so one and two are gone is available now and then I will separate it with the logo for Disney in my toilet and I'll do the same so every book and it's just one page so you're not going to have sub pages sub pages sub pages the only difference is when you go to buy and I'm going to create the purchase links it'll take you to the purchase page other than that but all the comics so all those sub pages for the comic books will be gone everything that you see that you saw here um, on the comics so cosmic words forbidden duty the videos and the cast of crazies will be no longer available on the site it'll be just just one page easy peasy one-stop shop same thing for the books and i'm going to reposition um i think i want let me see can i do that yeah so the comics portion will probably go up here i can move that here without any issues let's see yep so that's what i did so i moved the comics first so it's the home the comics, the books, um, the podcast, then it'll be the about, the bio, it'll be the about, the portfolio, and then the blog. That's it. So it'll be just six links on top, 
no more drama save that for your mama um and that's what we're gonna do so right now currently i have to add so catch the crazies i have to add how many covers are missing variant cover is missing for issue number two um and then the, the graphic novel cover for issue number for with a cover for issue number four that one's currently being colored so i'll put the variant cover for issue number two here so let's go to add so that's what, what what i love about wix is that it gives you these uh, it's so simple to use there's a lot of great functions uh and options so if i go to add the image i created folders so is it crazies and that and so here do i even have it yes there it is so there's the retro homage cover that's going to go in there and then i have to add the certificate of authenticity as well so i add these two to the page so that you know as that with the homage cover you're going to get a, a certificate of authenticity numbered and move this down and everything's easy to scale This is number three, right? Yes, that goes here. And let's, I want to make sure everything is the same size and it'll tell me. Bung. And you come with this certificate of authenticity. Right there. There. So that goes there. So that's number three. Um, I might move you over here. No, but you have to stay with three. But now nah, I'm going to move here. So this is it cover here and then with the text is it simply as just copying this right like control C and then hit control V and you get the text again and you just get her um, three variant homage cover and coming soon this is going to be coming soon first printing would be june june 2021 boom so that's there and this one oh i gotta put this right here and then just copy the coming soon copy v right here bomb one's coming soon and then I'll take this text here can we see copy V it's simple as that it's easy it's not there's nothing complicated about this bad boy um, maybe move this coming soon here let's move this over change the type here certificate of or and <laughs> hey Sam stop talking out loud yeah I know sorry signed and numbered oh I have to put comes with comes with a boom So maybe I will see I just want Alright. So for Cast the Crazies, I wanna make it simple. I'm gonna leave that page there, that that spot there, because the next cover is the um issue four cover and then the graphic novel. So the next campaign will probably be in August um, and it will be for the trade, the graphic novel, um, the first four issues, but uh, it will also come as a single issue, number four, so you can either get the single issue or the collected edition. Um, so I'm going to add that. 
And what's great about also working in Wix, it auto saves. So it'll show you on the top that it's been saved until you're ready to publish. So once this page is done, I'm going to uh, um, upload everything. And I don't know if I have that cover yet in here, so I might have to upload it. Yeah, I'm gonna have to upload it. I don't have it. So. have folders on my folders so on one high drive I have all of cast the crazy uh, and so if I go to name say for New York Times, issue three I'm just looking at you I don't know if I have anything So sometimes I just have to space bar to see what am I looking at. Um, that's commission art. That's that, that's that, that's that. Is this the one? No. Here's the Golden Age cover. That's also available. Huh, I wonder. Anyway. So let's see. No, you're not here. Let's go to, uh, where would I have that cover? Here it is. So that's that, but I need it. All right, so what you're going to find me doing now. All right, so let's open this up. So I'm now I'm gonna, what I'm doing is I'm opening up. Oh, no, I didn't want to upload that. Oh, sorry. Let's go to my desktop. All right, so desktop character profiles. That was the retro cover. You probably didn't even see this. This is the page that I um, that uh, I illustrated for the last Kickstarter. It was one of the options that you get to buy and write your own one-page story, and this is the story that I did. Uh, it was pretty cool. Uh, let's see. So this is the, the, the tedious part about, um, so I have this character profile folder that's not linked to my any of my external hard drives. It's on a shared folder because off of my Dell, when I'm drawing all of the stuff that I'm drawing on my uh, Wacom tablet um, is, is linked to the cloud into that folder. And then I have to transfer those images to the hard drives. And sometimes I forget. So now what it is, is that I'm looking at, let me see, looking out door. Door. Uh, this is the one that I want. I want it. There it is. That's what I'm looking for. All right. So let's open you up. I'm going to open up Affinity. And this is what I do all day. Um, so one of the things that you know, I guess nobody sees is the production stuff that's happening on the back end. Um, because I have to maintain the website. I have to maintain all of the social platforms. Um, draw, edit, all these things. So, uh, so right now, I realize that I don't have it as a JPEG. I don't know why. Uh, so I have to create the JPEG and upload that to the site. Oh, okay. 
this is it. So I'm just gonna put the help. Um, yeah, I'll export. And the JPEG, there it is. Bang. That's a big file. That's low def. Threshold to uh, 1200. Right there, you go. Better. Best quality. And you're gonna hear my dogs, unfortunately, because they like to act up. Road trip. Oh, here I got the road trip. So let me put this into uh, my book. The crazies. Uh, PNG. So save. All right. So then I'll close this. And I'll upload. So what are the things whenever you upload anything and that uh, Wix allows you to do? So here, if I click this and I go to tags, I can edit the tags. So this way is searchable on um, in Google. So I'll give it a gesture, art, painting, uh, electric blue, uh, uh, fictional characters. So I'll leave what those things, the yellow and all that stuff there, but I'll put um, catch the crazies graphic novel podcasters supernatural um zombies right and then i'll put crazy comics right and i'll do it two ways all right so i'm adding all of the um um the relevant stuff so it can come up um, and I'll put cartoon and animated. Okay, so it's done. And then I'll add that to page. So at least the tag's there. And then I'll scale it. Oh. All right, so let's get this over here. So there it is. So this is the, that's the cover for the um, graphic novel uh, for the collected edition. So that, and again, I'll just copy and paste. And I'm sorry for my dogs, but um, you know, they're not home. They're not, uh, they don't have social skills. They don't understand when uh, Pops is uh, working. They just know how to be kids. And the one that's actually barking is Rena. No, I'm sorry, that's not Rena. That's Lily. I'm sorry. Sorry. Rest in peace, Rena. Uh, Rena was my first love. Uh, she was a chihuahua she passed away but this is Lily we, she was a rescue um, I should be talking about this but I guess I'll share that story she was a rescue we went to a uh, fundraiser for the SPCA in Texas it was a black tie event where people were raising a lot of money um, and it was just after the Houston flood and uh, as I'm talking now copy and paste and it was just right after the Houston flood and this needs to over so what I need to do is move this over there you go. So you get this over it was just after the Houston flood um, and so she was there she was one she was rescued from a puppy mill and my wife pulled her out of the, they had um, a crib and put her in my arms and that little stinker, she decided to win me over because she put her paws in my uh, suit pocket where my pocket square would go and she put her head on my shoulders and she basically marked me, she says he's mine. And uh, so we wind up adopting her. We wind up uh, going to the uh, SPCA location in Dallas that next morning because we were flying out that day, the next day. Uh, we picked her up, got the paperwork. Um, I ordered, you know, booked a flight for her <laughs> to return and that's, that was what it is. So this is going to be fall 2020. Uh, fall. Fall 2021. Uh, collected. Collected. Um, all right. All right, so there's the cover for that. So that 
that's basically uh so this is out of whack here um maybe i just put you down here and make this simple keep this right here boom and so as you can see some of these images overlap and you don't want that because what happens is on a mobile device wix will make it look all crazy so i have to make sure that none of this overlaps so i'll fix that in a minute get this back down here so i have some synergy everything is copacetic and i'll put this down here right maybe i'll put it right here in the center boom there you go so there it is so that's that part so um and that's how it's basically going to be and if you want to see the art it'll be in my portfolio page so one of the things i didn't do i put all of my old images in my portfolio page i never actually put my new stuff so instead of having all these pages and sub pages this is, that's what i'm going to do i'm going to uh this so you see the inconsistency so maybe this goes down here boom and maybe this goes down here boom there you go there you go so that way that's there and then i can just like there's too much space so maybe i'll just bring this up a little there's all those little details um that make a difference when you're Doing this stuff you know there's no right or wrong it's just um, I'm looking for a more easier experience and trying to get more traffic to the site and I think what happens is people come they get claustrophobic <laughs> I don't know what it is or overwhelmed they're like oh this is just too much who does Sam think he is Marvel Comics so uh and I apologize because I'm eating eggs and it's dry as heck. So you'll see this big gap between that and that. So for the most part, this is done. And what I'll do is I'll continue to add as each issue comes along. This is not, the look is done. I still have to add the order section. Um, so since you're here, what I'll do is, uh, Let's just go and start working on the order. So this, the order here, and the link goes to where? The link goes to product page, right? So let's go look at the product page real quick so you can see where it goes. Uh, navigate to Page that one. Let's go to shop. There we go. So all of this is the ebook, all the ebooks, and I'm gonna change. I gotta change all of it. So what we're gonna do is, what I don't have available are the physicals so the ebooks are done so let's go back to the comic page comics let's add a button this button uh, where is it join us sale click me download send show more let's go. order now i just don't like to look at that button Pay buttons, there you go, pay buttons. Buy now. This is the part. Uh, I want this right here. Buy now.
put this here by now now let's edit this add paypal info <sighs> what's the product's name I want to add an id number where's the price So here's where I have to make sure. So as you can see on the pages, added asking you for all this, right? Information. So I'm just gonna put the buttons there. This is some, uh, and then I'll edit these later. So this is gonna be there. And that's for this book. So and then I'll have another one here for this book and then I have to what I'm going to do is I have my scale and if you're ordering just a single copy number one then what I'll do is um, I'll make sure that the, the shipping cost um, is added to that price so to make it easier and then I have to so what are things that if you're creating your own store and you're, you're shipping stuff from your own house. You have to make sure to include certain disclaimers, like for instance, um, shipping costs relevant to number of items. So the weight will determine the shipping costs. Um, so what happens is, you know, someone might say, I'm gonna add that to the cart. I'm gonna add that to the cart. I'm gonna add that to the cart. And then it got bigger, right? And so you wanna make sure. So one of the things I'm, I, I'm trying to figure out is, um, how do I make this seamless so that way when if you're selecting multiple items um, you're not getting that same shipping cost multiple times make sense I want to be able to you can add to cart so instead of the buy now I want to add it to carts let me delete that I don't want that I want to add to cart function uh, donate PayPal button, sell downloads, magic button, related apps. Uh, let's see. Shopping cart. That's what let me see. Shopping cart. Add to cart. There you go. So yeah, that's gonna take me some time to do that. So maybe I'll do that on another episode with you guys. Right now, I'm just gonna design because it's gonna take. As you can see, I have to go back and just make sure that everything works the way I want it to work. Let me move this up. You see how that overlaps with that one? So I didn't want that to overlap there. Um, so well, that's happening. So I got this, forbidden is done. So now, if you wanna move anything down, here you go. You have to highlight this and uh, drag, right? So you have to drag it down. So I have to create enough space for the logo for this new one. Right here so then I'll go to add image images that I uploaded already so now because I didn't create a folder for Disney in my toilet I have to go look for the logo here we go so there's the logo and let's make sure my tags what does it say yep I did it all the tags so again the tags are important uh, so then it'll be there. So then there's the, there's the separation. So you want to be able to um, show whoever's on your page the difference as they're scrolling down. They're going to see the different books, but it's always good to have the title. So I start off with going back up. Cast the crazies on the top. And then I come down to forbidden. And the reason why I started with those, even though I created Disney in my toilet before both of these, actually forbidden was created before all of them. It's because we launched the books recently. And so there's Neil in my toilet um, will be available. I will be doing a Kickstarter campaign for the graphic novel, the colored edition um, uh, in the fall. So look for that to come. Uh, so, and they're available as eBooks on Amazon and Barnes and Nobles and Cosmic Wars as well. So I'll separate that. And because these these are part of the Disneyland My Toilet um, series, they're all going to be moved here. So right now, what I have to do is add all of the covers to this. So 
So we're gonna move you guys down. Guys, but oh no, I gotta. There we go. Move you guys down. And now we're gonna do all the other covers for Disney and my toilet. Is issues one through five are complete. Completed, so we want to make sure I get them all in there. And this is the mundane stuff. This is the stuff that takes a minute. Um, putting all of this together. So there's that cover. It's not a cover. That's I am That's another cover, but I'll put that later. I'm looking for Disney with my toilet covers. And you can see the inventory. Uh, the amount of art. And you got some preview pages. So here's one cover. Right, here's another cover. Okay. We're getting somewhere. We're getting somewhere. I just did that one, right? Yeah, I just did that one. Yeah, stop playing around. Alright, just did that one. Edition. We're gonna get that in there. Okay. There's a lot of variant covers, and this one I don't know. So let's add them to the page, and then if I added too many, I'll fix that later. Go one more time. Everybody's doing fine here. This one's gonna go. And this is number three. Let you go. Go the other way. This is number four. Got it twice. Let's get that away for a second. The collected edition volume one. That's available to buy on my site now. I think I have 50 units left on inventory. I already have four, so I don't need that in again. Um, here's number five. So I need issue number two, which is I see red people. All right, so let's get these bad boys going. So this is number five. Let's get you over here. Let's figure this out. This is number four. This is the graphic novel, so we're gonna move you here for a second. I need you over. Sure, they all scale to the same size. Right. The collected edition. So this is going to be This is not the not so glamorous stuff in the order button should be a little bit. So why is it why is the text so um why is the text not proportionate? Oh there it is. So now I have to find number two. I see red people. Where are you? Go down.
Okay. That one. I have the actual one. That's gonna change a little from my computer. I was I was just about to say if you have any questions, but I realize I'm not live. Great. I should have done this live. I might have gotten a lot of. Uh, if you guys want me to do the live portion where I'm doing the store, let me know. Um, if I get enough demand, I'll do it. So there's nearly my toilet. It's in this drive. So we gotta go to my Dell files. And I need to my toilet. And I think it was number two, right? We have to cover. That's not it. See if I can uh pull you let me open this up with you know what? I'm gonna open this up. I don't know why I don't have it as a let me go here, let me go ant cover. This is the one, but that's a small file. Let's see if I can get that up there. Boom. Mundane. All right, so now let's uh, tags. Edit the tags. Again, remember, so you got clouds, you got sky. Yeah, that's all in there. Organism, now red, yes. Terrestrial plant, <laughs> that's cool. I like that. Uh, let's see. Ant. Red ants. Alien. UFO. Uh, Martian. There's an alien in my toilet. Duty. Samuel Vera. Crazy comics. Hit done and I'll add that to the page. Beautiful. One shot, one, one stop. Make sure everything's aligned. Bingo. So there's issue one, issue two, issue three. Issue four or five. I'm sorry. One, two, three, four, five. And then the collected. So maybe spread them out. Oh, but yeah, no, maybe I can just let's get you over here. Let's get you closer. Get you closer. That big red freshness lasts right through it. Yes, yeah, so I can get you up here. There you go. And then I just look. There you go. Size it up. Boom. And they all fit. So this will now I have to add the titles. Oh gosh. Oh. I'm tired, man. Oh, so this is what it's like waking up in the morning 
Uh, first thing I do is come here. I usually have a I work out and have my cup of coffee, but today I decided not to work out. Cause I've been working out every day this week, and I decided to take a break. And you know what I've been addicted to? Dipsy Doodles. The barbecue and the regular Dipsy Doodles. Oh, my wise. Oh, I love them. It's just the bomb. So now let's go up here. Let's see. Let's Command C, Command V. All right, so now take that text, bring it down here, and we're going to uh, change this. So we are going to first we'll do this. All right, and then we're going to bring this up. Shush. Okay. All right, let's get this up here. That's too much stuff. So. I'd have to lower this to get all this information in here. So all, to lower all four, of, five of them, just do that. Um, there you go. Then I need this to be centered. So edit text. Go here and center it. Cool. This way it looks good. That way. That's just how I like it. All right. So I name my toilet. Uh, I see red people. I'll just put number two. There we go. Boom. So now, see. Each one will have his description. Number three. Number four. Cover. Then there, boom. So now the entire inventory for designated my toilet is available. So if we scroll back up again, we'll get to the book page. I mean, it feels good to know that I've done all this stuff, um, but it's just tedious to, you know, because I worked on the site and I'm not happy with the site and I'm trying to fix the site. And um, I just wanted, you know, in today's era where people don't. make the time or have the time uh, or spend the time or invest the time um, you want to make it as easy as possible so when they go there if they say I'm looking for comics by Sam they just go to the comic page no sublinks and then boom it, there it is and they can just scroll down oh shit oh snaps <laughs> uh, Sam did all this uh, uh, let, me, um, let me order this and let me order this and let me order this the store is going to take me a minute because I need to make sure that I have add to shopping cart function and that it automatically calculates the um, the shipping cost. So then you see you got goes down to forbidden, goes down to Disney in my toilet. Boom. Everything's right there. And then, but now remember what I said. This is all part of the Disney in my to toilet series. So this is more. So I'm going to change all this. So, um, Scrolled this cosmic war, it will end it with cosmic wars. Um, as my last uh comic book series, I won't be doing cosmic wars, finishing it. So, cosmic wars I produced years ago. A lot of you know this already, and I've done two issues 
uh, I started on the third, never never completed it. Uh, so the two issues will be available for purchase um, until sometime in the future uh, I can get to finishing it. So you here, so this is moving up here. All right, so we're going to uh, part of the same series. So I want to make certain that uh, I keep everything together. So when people say, "What is high on duty?" It looks just like duty. It is duty. It's just the, I, uh, the intention was to create this new my toilet as. Um, a mini series and then spin off to high on duty i might just change it to high on duty and um uh but for right now um, this is where it is so i'm gonna take this move this up here i'm gonna change all of this because the font size is too big there you go and that I don't need this here. Number one. I don't know why that number one is so small. Okay, a little better. Um, it's gonna go down. This needs to go over. Alright, so I'll, I'll finish. I'll fix that in a minute. Let's get you. Kindle button right here. It's available on Kindle. Um, it's also visible. It's also available on Barnes and Noble. So I don't know why I didn't even add that there. So I have to move this here. So as you, again, so the Cosmic Wars will go down. To make room, you don't want any of that stuff to overlap because um, Wix don't play like that. That's there. Uh, and now I'm going to move. Herman. This was another book that I wrote. And it's a spinoff. Again, Herman gets his own book because he became this breakout star from the nail in my toilet. And um, there, boom, same size. Uh, and I never really got to finish his series uh, or do it. Um, I created all the characters, the character designs, the bios, the backstory, the, the first script, done. Um, now, maybe maybe I'll commission somebody to draw it, who knows. Um, maybe if I raise enough money from uh, doing the uh, graphic novel in color, that'll give me an opportunity to uh, um, really do uh, Herman. Change the Cosmic Wars logo because it's kind of old. And this is coming soon here. Oh, it's not centered. So, the high end these for me, Anus, it'll also be available in a physical format as well. You'll get that issue in the, cre the, the graphic novel of Disney in my toilet. So, I'm going to. I might change the Cosmic Wars logo but right now i need to make room for cosmic wars um, and bring the logo in right here so let's add that logo now mind you i have to overhaul the whole site and i'm still just on the comic page i have to do the same exact thing to the book page i'm just letting you know so that's why it's uh it's tedious. So I'm looking for Cosmic Wars, right? Where's the logo? Yeah. Sorry to eat while I'm doing this, but I have my eggs. There it is.
Yeah. Got it. Sure there's no overlap on anything. So that would be I have to add that's issue zero that cover. I have to add issue number one cover into this layout. Um, but so here it is, this is what it looks like. Um, this is my entire inventory of books uh, that I've created. Um, comic books because I also have the children's books the coloring books um, I have sketchbooks uh, so I'm trying to make it all easier and I will be launching the website with all of the full functions um, in a few days and I will announce it and so now you'll be able to get the physical I decided to um, uh, you know, I do print on demand. Uh, I have an inventory of books, and I decided to just uh, take the orders directly and go from there. And and, uh, and truly take being a brokepreneur um, seriously. So that's me using Wix to uh, work on my page for crazycomics.com or icreatestories.com. It's all the same place. All right, if you have any questions, if there's anything you would like me to do with Wix on my website and show you any demonstrations hey hit me up let me know I'm, I'm going to do that if you want me to go live I need several I need more than just one person if you want me to go live uh, I can schedule a live event uh, just uh, maybe do the store functions uh, whatever it is do that uh, remember forbidden number one will be launching on Kickstarter um, in a few weeks, I don't have the exact date because Kickstarter won't let me launch the landing page until they've reconciled the cast the crazies and they still haven't collected all the funds. They're still working on that. Um, still, people, a couple of people they have to work with. And um, if you're in Pennsylvania, PA, um, meet me and John at the Cycle Cyfax at uh, ZoloCon. In fact, let me show you what that image I just did for ZoloCon looks like. Um, where did I do it? I did it. Yeah, it's in the. Let me open up that folder. If you haven't seen it yet, you're gonna see it now. Yeah, road trip. Here it is. Boom. Uh, road trip issue one. Boom. There it is. The road trip. That's your boy, the crazy man, and Jonathan, the psycho side facts. We're hitting the road. We're hitting the Colt Zolo Con. And we're gonna document every step of the way. We're gonna vlog it and have fun so look for your boys over there in july and in um august meet us at eternacon if you're going to be there in long island and um, um we will be documenting that as well and again if you're a convention promoter and if uh you're looking for podcasts to do a panel hit us up at cast the craze we're more than willing to do it um you know we could talk about branding we could talk about um Outros, intros, production, whatever it is, uh, let us know. Hook us up, DM us. Again, subscribe. Give me a thumbs up if you like this episode. Uh, hit that link below. Uh, subscribe. Share this with a friend. Uh, and if you if you listen to us on any channels, uh, please follow us on Podbean. And uh, I appreciate you. So this is me working on Wix. Thank you all so much. Talk to you soon.